Hello guys, Goronkraft here, and I have a cape. Do you guys have a cape as well? I don't know what it is. I think it's pretty cool though. Anyway, I made a sugarcane farm design that I would like to share with you guys today, right now. Why do I have so much sugarcane in my hand? Um, let's just go into normal mode. And here's my design. Well, it's not finished yet, alright? I have not really gone into the details yet, but I, it's a concept. And I think it's a pretty interesting concept. Uh, it's based on the mob sweeper. You guys might know, uh, as soon as like the slime block there, uh, ability to drag each other and everything, as soon as that got, that got introduced, people started to make mob sweepers. So basically this thing over here, if I just turn it on, it goes up and down and it sweeps whatever's in front of it. So. If there would be a bunch of mobs standing there, like a bunch of zombies, they would all get pushed down and fall to their death. And that is very neat. And uh, this is a design by Mumbo Jumbo that has been upgraded by another dude, which I will link in the description. I forgot his channel name. Uh, but that's all linked in the description. His uh, design for the sweeper. Uh, it's originally a concept by Mumbo Jumbo. He made it better. And then I made it into this, the sugarcane swiper. So have these plants been growing any yet? No. So let's just go to game rule, random tick speed. It's on one, I think defaults 10 or something. But let's put it on 100 something something. It's 100 a lot, let's put it on a thousand. Uh, that should be cool. Yeah, and then immediately we see these sugar canes growing like, hey! Frames are dropping, sugar canes are growing. So we have lots of sugar cane. They grew. And then we will, if I just activate the swiper, it's breaking it. Isn't that awesome? Whoa, it's shooting them off as well, right? Is it? Because that is really neat, actually. Because one of the problems that I had with this farm uh, is that I could not really come up with a good way to one make this uh, sweeper go off only like once a minute or once every five minutes I think that would be good like once every let's just say three minutes once every three minutes this sweeper should go off and farm whatever sugarcane there is that would be really neat and the other problem I ran into um, why would you use the sweeper design over like other designs? Well, the other designs all had one big row of sugarcane and then one piston pushing them. Wow, this is really tanking the frames. Jeez. Um, but you always had one row of sugarcane and one piston pushing them. What we have over here is a field of sugarcane. It's actually the most, uh, it's actually the densest field of sugarcane that you can have in Minecraft. This is the most com most compact sugarcane field. It's the most sugarcane you can have. And that's all packed together and that's being mowed down by the sweeper. It's really efficient. It should get you tons and tons of sugarcane quite easily and quite quickly. So the only problem was with all these water sources scattered around kind of random, um, my first idea was to have a hopper minecart go underneath here picking up everything but of course that's not really going to work out because you are going to run into trouble. So the only thing you could do to have a minecart down there that's actually doing stuff is when you have all these water sources be created by ice. So you lay down all your minecart tracks down there, down here, and you make the hopper minecart uh, right around in there and you would have these water sources be created by melting ice because then they would not uh, flow over the rails and you would be a very happy man. Wow, the frames just completely died. That is interesting. But you will have this problem of the shooting thing. So you could actually make something that catches those and puts them into normal hoppers because it's look at how much shooting. All right, we are on tick speed of thousand. That that might change some things, but this is awesome. Um, so. All the redstone you need is right over here. So you have this little clock, which is explained in the other video I showed to you. And then take your screenshots, because this is it. And then that's the sweeper. And 
this is the sugar cane. It's it's really this is it. This is what I made, and I would love to see some guys try to make this more efficient. Try to come up with a, a collector system, so a way to collect all the sugar cane. And something I could not come up with myself was a way to trigger the the sweeper only like once a minute or once every three minutes. Because then this if this is going all the time like it is now. It would only work at, <laughs> at tick speed a thousand, and of course, that's not supposed to be. Because uh, I think the default is ten. Oh wow, that. What? Why is it going faster now? Oh well. So the default is ten. So I don't know if these sugar canes are going to grow now. That's the only. That's the problem. Yeah. Anyway, I think I've showed off enough of the sugar cane design. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like if you think this is a good design. And make sure to to have a look if you can improve the design. Because I I don't I'm not good at redstone. You should know that. I think I haven't said it yet, but I am really bad at redstone. Really, really bad. So what I challenge you to do is just improve my design. I probably made a lot of stupid mistakes. All right. So we have one sugar cane grown right now. That's not a lot. So it is currently it's just not efficient because it's only doing it every once. It, it's constantly going over them and stopping them from growing. I think. So that's not good. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in another video, perhaps. Goodbye.